A revived Everton will want to take advantage of a wobbling Tottenham when the sides meet at Goodison Park on Saturday. David Moyes has overseen a run of six games without defeat, despite the distraction of a run to the quarter-finals of the FA Cup. Tottenham struggled past lowly Stevenage to reach the same stage of that competition. They've also seen their unlikely title credentials come under the spotlight recently after heavy defeats to Arsenal and Manchester United. And while he's been encouraged by his players' performances, Spurs boss Harry Redknapp is all too aware of the threat Everton pose. Well, it's a tough game, Everton away. You know, you don't go to Everton away and think, well, it's a, this is a, a nailed-on win. It's, it's a very difficult place to go. You never get an easy game with Everton home or away, so to go there is always difficult. And, you know, we had two defeats, but in all honesty, I mean, yeah, OK, we lost away at Arsenal, but Arsenal showed you the other night when they, that first half against Milan, what they're capable of doing. So that's what they did to us second half. So that was different, you know, we had a, got beat there and then Man United at home, I was pleased with the performance. Uh, couldn't have asked for any more, really. Um, just didn't get the breaks on the day, but... You know, so we've not been in bad form. Spurs will be without Michael Dawson after the defender was stretched off in the FA Cup tie against Stevenage with ankle ligament damage. Aaron Lennon is also absent with a hamstring injury. Everton are bolstered by the return to fitness of Leon Osman, Nikita Jelovic and Seamus Coleman, who all came on as substitutes against QPR last week. The Toffees were beaten 2-0 by Tottenham in the corresponding fixture in January. But with home wins against high-flying Manchester City and Chelsea since then, they won't be phased by the visit of another big team.